Hey there, Tom here from the Miles Academy. Ready to unlock the secrets of credit card rewards? Let's dive in and explore how you can turn everyday spending into something extraordinary. What exactly are credit card rewards? Think of them as loyalty currencies, like a special kind of money you earn just by using your credit card. Just like any other currency, these rewards can be super valuable. But the best part, you're getting rewarded for purchases you're already making. Now you might be wondering, what kind of rewards are we talking about? There are three main types of credit card rewards that you should know about. Cashback, miles, and points. Each of these has its own unique perks, so let's break them down. First up, cashback. This one's straightforward. Every time you use your card, you get a percentage of your spending back in cash. Usually this ranges from 1% to 5%, sometimes more. Imagine you're buying groceries, filling up your car with gas, or grabbing a cup of coffee. Each of these purchases is earning you cash back. Over time, that small percentage adds up, and you can use this cash to pay off your credit card bill or even get a check directly sent to your bank. It's like getting paid to spend. Next on the list, we have miles. These rewards are especially awesome for travelers. Miles are tied to specific airlines or hotels, like American Airlines Miles or Hilton Points. You can rack up these miles and use them to book free or discounted travel. Think about earning miles with every flight you take or every hotel stay you book. Before you know it, you'll have enough for your next adventure. And then there are points. Points are probably the most versatile of all credit card rewards. They can be redeemed for a variety of things, including cashback, travel, merchandise, gift cards, and more. These points are typically managed by banks or other financial institutions. For example, Capital One points or even Chase Ultimate Rewards. They can be used in so many ways that they almost feel like a Swiss Army knife of rewards. Sometimes people get confused between miles and points. Here's a tip. Miles are usually tied to airlines or hotels, while points are managed by banks and other financial institutions. So when you hear miles, think travel. And when you hear points, think flexibility. Now that we've covered the types of rewards, let's talk about how you actually earn them. There are two main ways, regular spending and sign-up bonuses. Every time you swipe your card for everyday purchases like groceries, gas, or dining out, you're earning rewards. Some cards even offer bonus points or miles for specific categories like travel or dining. But here's where things really get interesting. Sign-up bonuses. These are one-time bonuses you can earn when you first get a new credit card. You've probably seen offers like earn 50,000 points after spending $2,500 in the first three months. That's a sign-up bonus, and it's one of the fastest ways to supercharge your rewards balance. Just meet the minimum spending requirement, and boom, those bonus points and miles are yours. Now let's talk about redeeming those rewards. Cashback is the simplest. You can redeem it anytime, either as a statement credit on your credit card or by getting a check sent to your bank account. Miles, they get deposited into your airline or hotel account. Ready to book your next trip? Points, they're stored in your bank's loyalty account. You can redeem them anytime for travel, merchandise, gift cards, cash back, and more. The flexibility of points makes them incredibly valuable. You can tailor your rewards to fit your needs. But how much are these cards really worth? Well, it depends. Think of them like foreign currencies. 10,000 Mexican pesos isn't exactly the same as 10,000 US dollars, right? Same goes for points and miles. The values vary. So it's all about what you can get with them. The key is to focus on what you want to use the points or miles for. For example, if you're planning a big trip, it might make sense to save up your points for travel rather than cashing them out for gift cards. Or if you're eyeing the next big purchase, cash bag could be the way to go. The beauty of credit card rewards is that they give you options, whether it's a flight from Miami to Akron, a hotel stay for your kids' travel ball team, or even a business class ticket for you and the wife to Tahiti. The possibilities are endless. You are in complete control of how you use your rewards, so make sure you get the most out of them. Now, enjoy your journey and all of the fantastic opportunities that lie ahead.